She's running to be New York City's next district attorney. My name is Tahani. Oh, you know me, okay. The top prosecutor in America's largest city. I appreciate you. However, Tahani Abushi's first experience of the criminal justice system didn't come in law school, but when she was only 14 years old. That's when her father was sentenced to 22 years in prison for selling untaxed cigarettes in the family convenience store in Brooklyn. My priorities are addressing the racism against communities of color, holding the police accountable, and stop letting people who are powerful and privileged get away with things. Abushi is pledging to fix a criminal justice system she calls racist. Police brutality is a big problem for communities of color, and we have to understand that police officers have a lot of power to not only infringe on our constitutional rights, but to restrict our freedom and then present us to the prosecution system. There are eight people running for district attorney of Manhattan, including Iranian-born Talia Farhadian Weinstein. We do hard work and we speak to the people. But with no experience as a prosecutor, Abushi, a child of Palestinian immigrants, was once a long shot to win the race. We're with Tahani because she's with us. But after some high-profile endorsements, her prospects have risen significantly. Abushi grew up here in Harlem in New York City. She has a real authentic connection to people, and it was obvious to see when she was out campaigning. The race is coming up June 22nd. I'm a civil rights lawyer. And when Abushi says the criminal justice system is not working, at least one former federal prosecutor told me she's partially right. The guiding goals of the criminal justice system generally are sound, but the way things have been implemented have drastically hurt people of color, people who don't have a lot of money, who don't have a lot of power. Whoever is the next district attorney of Manhattan, they'll also have to decide how or if to proceed with the criminal investigation into former President Donald Trump's finances. For now, that is something Abushi doesn't want to comment on. Do you vote here in Manhattan? Yeah. She's okay. focused on criminal justice reform and holding police rather than presidents accountable. Thank you. Gabriel Ozondo, Al Jazeera, New York.